Former Uruguayan Foreign Minister Luis Almagro took office as OAS Secretary General today. The Uruguayan diplomat was elected as Secretary General on March 18 with 33 votes in favor, one abstention, and no votes against foreign member states. The Secretary General has reaffirmed the OAS support to Belize and Guatemala in the resolution of the territorial deferenda. During his visit to Guatemala, Almagro reaffirmed the organization's commitment to continue supporting Belize and Guatemala, saying that both countries need to move ahead with their efforts to arrive at a final and definitive settlement to the dispute. Almagro took office during a special meeting of the Permanent Council. Here is that short report, courtesy the OAS office. Luis Almagro has assumed office as Secretary General of the Organization of American States. In his inaugural speech at OAS headquarters in Washington, the new OAS leader said the issue of inequality is one of the greatest concerns in the region and would be a priority during his term in office. That is why my administration will focus on the slogan, More Rights for More People, because the hemisphere is fed up with exclusion. It is tired of racism, persecution, prejudices, and sterile antagonisms. Secretary General Almagro said the priorities of his administration would include citizen security, more accountable governance, the prevention of social conflicts and management of natural disasters, interconnectivity in the Caribbean, and the creation of a Pan-American educational system. He added that he would strengthen efforts to fight corruption and work for the full reintegration of Cuba into the OAS. In his conclusion, Almagro called for a renewed focus on the goals of the organization. I want to urge governments, their representatives in the Permanent Council, the staff of the OAS, all the parts of the inter-American system, and the partners of the OAS to work together with the General Secretariat starting today to align the activities of the organization to the vision of an OAS closer to the people, more efficient, less bureaucratic, and that contributes to the resolution of problems of our hemisphere and its citizens. Chair of the Permanent Council and Permanent Representative of Trinidad and Tobago, Neil Parsan, highlighted the support of member states for the agenda of the new leader of the OAS. You submitted for consideration of the member states an agenda that will ascertain and address hemispheric realities and needs. And with your election, you have received a clear mandate to implement that agenda. Rest assured that you can count on the full support of, for your efforts to rev revitalize the Organization of American States. After being sworn in as Secretary General, Almagro took time to greet representatives of OAS member states. Secretary General Almagro was elected for a period of five years from May 2015 to May 2020. He is the second Uruguayan to lead 